Hey guys, it's Jen from Scan and Cut Canvas and Scale Help on Facebook. This is a very quick tutorial on how to cut rhinestone templates. It is very important that you do this before you start cutting any rhinestone templates. Okay, so what I've done is just from the shape library, I've come over here and chosen a rectangle. You can use whatever simple shape you want. Okay, you can come up and do your object duplicate. Okay, and let's do three columns. You can do four rows, whatever you think you may need. Okay, you can space them out. Okay, all right. This one, I'm only using SS10, so this will be my SS10 template. And I know because I have used this before that I have to go big, okay? Because my 10s do not fit. So let's try the SS12, okay? And I'm using round. I don't want to fill the shape. I just need the outside, okay, to tell me if my 12s, the SS12 hole in Sure Cuts a Lot are going to fit the SS10 stones that I have. Also, please note that even though you have an SS10, you have some Koreans, you have some DMCs, you have something else. They can all be different sizes as well. What I recommend that you do is that you have them all in separate containers unless and until you test them between each other. If they all fit size 12, then great. Then you can put them all in a container that says use SS12 in sure cuts a lot, okay? So this one's going to be okay. Now I'm going to click this one. Effects, rhinestones. That was my SS12. And you can write this on a piece of paper so you remember. Now this one, because there's two 13s, how am I going to indicate this? Well, what I do is I write SS12 inside of this one. I'm going to write SMSS13 inside of this one. That tells me it's the small SS13. Then I'll write LG SS13 inside of this one. That means it's the largest SS13, okay? All right, so I want round preview. Yep, that looks good. Okay, click on this one. Effects, rhinestones. Let's go get the large. Oh, goodness, I get a little happy with my clicker. Here's the large SS13 round preview yep that looks good okay click this one effects rhinestones and we'll go to the 14 and I'm gonna tell you something okay you don't need to test them if you have the same stone so let's say you're using uh, Korean stones you do not have to test them if you're using the same stones and you're using the same version of Sure Cuts a Lot, okay? So I'm using version 4.063. Okay, I'm getting myself confused. Um, I'm using version 4.063. So this is why I'm doing this, because I have not done... this in a long time so I need to just to make sure nothing has changed to make sure that my stones still fit okay so don't ever take anything for granted all right and I'll do then the largest 15 round preview okay so now I don't really need any of these so I can get rid of them. Okay. Now I can file, export, and send this off to my stick. Okay? But this is how you create them. Then when you're done, and I'm actually going to show you this in the uh, rhinestone video part two, how to use this. Alright guys? Thanks a lot. 